Ah, familiar ground. Welcome back to another video on this channel. Today I'm going to be playing as the Socialist Republic of Italy. Wait, haven't you played them already? Well, yes, dear viewer, I have. But seeing as they got a small rework, why not play them again? Not like I already did something like that. Anyway, as the Socialist Republic of Italy, I will try and unify Italy. You know, it seems kind of broken. So let's head in. All right, uh, Socialist Republic of Italy. I believe we uh, started with the same amount of divisions. I don't remember, but uh, yeah, they seem kind of under-equipped. Anyway, uh, we have two new national spirits. First, we have Danunzian Coalition. Increasing political power, cost, war support, and totalism support. And the other one is the Italian Chetniks. Reducing recruitable population factor, stability, and war support. And increasing daily paternal autocracy support. We have uh, the man himself as our second in command. Surely he's gonna, you know, be useful and not cause some problems. Anyway, here's the Fox Tree, which is uh, completely new. Yeah, looks better, honestly. Especially the political pass. Here are the political pass. Yeah, uh, with the unification pass. The industrial path and army, air force and navy. Uh, right now we cannot really, you know, start with uh, the political path, so let's, uh, I guess, do industry. So let's create the ENEL. This will be our research and we shall build two civilian factories and then just focus on military factories. And this will be our production line. I need more factories, honestly. And lastly, let's just put the army right there, train them to level 3. And yeah, then we can start. Um, yeah, um, um, there goes our coalition. Even less political power. That's great. Uh, let's actually convert them all to main infantry, so that I don't uh, waste fuel training them. <laughs> Capitalist economy has collapsed. Imagine having Black Monday. <laughs> uh, let's immediately get a chief of army so that I can get army experience. Uh, he's a specialist, so it's not gonna be a lot. The 1936 elections. Negotiations must start rapidly. We don't want another election. So let's uh, build a new government. I love building. The new compromise. The future of Italy is built from here. Now we have a balance of power between all the factions. And whichever factions in the end is, uh, you know, active, be the ruling party when we unify Italy. Well, this guy's now in charge, apparently. So let's try and uh, not make him <laughs> in charge later on. Let's also try and reduce the Italian jetniks. Let's get the great compromiser into our government. So after dealing with the Italian Chetniks for now, let's uh, expand the economy by maintaining regional unions. Well, I don't know what they did, but uh, apparently nothing good if Germany is attacking them. Let us get the influential intellectual. The new parliamentarists government. Good luck, Roselli. And for our last political advisor, let's get the economic reformer. Uh, what? The Pope is gone. <laughs> okay. Someone apparently did not like him. Let's start and mobilizing the economy. Let's mobilize it even further. Alright, let's try and uh, get some army buffs now. La Legione Proletaria. Let us expand construction. Uh, I don't have manpower. <laughs> let's expand the template. Let's get the infantry specialist. Let us begin the Risorgimento. Let us start and attack the Italian Republic. Oh, here come these guys. Uh, we also captured Milan. And uh, I'm trying to encircle this. Oh, what the... Oh, they, they kept. Oh, that, that was all that... Okay. Didn't even need Venice, okay. Uh, well, uh, yeah. They're not gonna have a fun time now. Old guys, uh, the encirclement and also Rome fell. Uh, yeah, goodbye German volunteers. Um, yep, they got overrun. And also, yeah, it's goodbye army of the two Sicilies. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're dead. Well, I don't think they're gonna survive that one. Uh, well, I have bad news for you guys, but uh, I'm gonna block the streets. Uh, wasn't probably the uh, smartest idea to cross. Probably wasn't the smartest idea. Goodbye. Oh, okay, they capitulated. Let me kill the volunteers, man. Boring. Anyway, uh, Italy United, let's go. Woohoo! Time to deal with more problems, probably. We can also now join the International. Uh, third International, my bad. The post war election. Uh, well, they are trying to officially annex Champione, so let's uh, teach them a lesson. Surely. Alright, uh, the, the the bald guy is gone. And now we can start uh, reforming. Yeah, Switzerland is gonna die now. I did not call in the, the other guys, just in case this will start a, a bigger war. Probably wouldn't have, but uh, whatever. Uh, Switzerland is gone now. Great. Uh, yep, yeah, that's... Um, Chetnik activities flare up. 
We will not be intimidated. Uh, this is very cool. Now we have to deal with them. Okay, uh, let's restore the Swiss state. But uh, like just a mini state here. I really want to know how they lose against Bulgaria. Even with the Ottomans intervening. I mean, the Ottomans won, but how did they not win? <laughs> Uh, whatever. It's, I don't care. It's, let's reconcile with like-minded Republicans. All uh, ringleaders apprehended. The sooner the better. Just one more time. Enforced secularism and then let's continue down with our political path here. Exiling the Pope. Get out of here. <laughs> Goodbye, Pope. I skipped the event, but the Pope arrived in Brazil, apparently. Have fun there. Finally a W for Brazil. The arrest of Marshal Caviglia. This is the beginning of the end. Uh, but that's... Uh, just have to do the focus here. Oh, and there goes the Italian Chetniks. Uh, good riddance. Let us break the enemies of democracy. Oh, we finally cut these states up there. Oh, well, Bulgaria victorious from their Balkan war. Uh, was trying to retake some territory, apparently. The Kingdom of Two Sicilies has also been caught now. Great. Let's help out the Hellenic Socialist Republic with our tanks. Speaking of tanks, this is the template. It's the same as always. And here's the chassis. If that, you know... If you want to copy it. Yeah, uh, yeah, or begin. Um, or let me finish this down there first. Yeah, let's uh, wait. Let's, um, yeah, let's join. I'm still training. <laughs> uh, let's make an offensive line and then just wait. Um, yeah, that happened, I guess. That's gonna be paid for them, I guess. <laughs> I pushed into the Alps. Uh, it's not gonna be fun. I started an offensive while the Germans are distracted with Poland. <laughs> Let's see how far I will get. Oh, we got far. Pushed him a bit hard in. Even into Germany. I'm just gonna wait till I get my other tanks ready. Oh, and circled some troops in the, the lowlands. Uh, this is going very slow. I, I had some rubber from Brazil, but um, let's say they changed sides. Ah, uh, so yeah. And now I don't split anymore. Uh, so I'm just gonna get some refineries now. Or else I'm gonna be rubberless. I need rubber. Okay, and you created a naval invasion that looks okay-ish now, still. And I connected to, uh, with them up here, so I guess it's a success if they don't fuck it up now. Well, if uh, Antwerp falls, then uh, they're gonna be encircled here. <laughs> so let's try and uh, capture it. I cannot believe the AI did one good naval invasion. That's the first time ever. Now it's gonna be the troops here finally gone. They have nowhere to run. The Netherlands are gone also. So let's uh, finish them off. They do have supplies because, you know, the uh, supply up from the capital of the Netherlands. Well, goodbye. That's casualties. But good news, my third tank that I trained is now ready. Uh, I guess this is gonna be uh, it for Germany. They lost everything in the east and the Russians are already pushing into them. Uh, it's gonna be a fun peace deal. Hey, I'm currently in Düsseldorf. I mean, the Saturday when the video drops. Uh, I'm literally there. I'm in the city. Um, yep, that's a few troops encircled now. <laughs> Let's try and kill the troops here encircled in Strasbourg. Yeah, that's gonna be quite a few casualties. Yeah, goodbye. Ah, uh, I think Germany's dead, guys. It's frontline <laughs> says everything. That's just pushing. Uh, yeah, this is fun. It's fun. Ah, uh, I should not look at Asia. This is giving me brain cancer. Looks like the <laughs> well, someone fled to Germany. Yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah, great. Collapse of the Reichspakt. Uh, yeah, peace deals, woohoo. Uh, the German army got deleted, great. Nothing standing in the way of conquest now. Let's just end this. Oh, and there goes Austria. Time to claim as much land as possible. Yep, that seems good. Uh, can I steal the navy? I can't. It's just one division. <laughs> uh, I believe they're dead now, right? Yeah. Well, goodbye, Germany. Uh, I'm just gonna give stuff to France that's not on their border in cares to the block of Russia. Anyway, let's steal some ships. <laughs> I love stealing ships. It's the most fun thing to do in Hoi 4. Stealing ships of your enemies. <laughs> ah, I forgot about Poland. This caused it too much. Uh, we're just gonna... Don't look at this, okay? I love how I can just trade with Germany Station now. Nothing happened between us, right? We're best friends. Why can I not give that away? <laughs> yeah. I can see it from miles away. Game? Hello? Anyway, let's plan to attack some other guys. Uh, probably wonder which one. You have no idea. You're never gonna guess it. That's Sardinia, by the way. 
That's... Uh, it's... I'm gonna activate Satan. That's what that is. <laughs> Alright, this looks uh, better. Uh, Alright, time to kill them. Yes, thanks for killing Uruguay, guys. Uh, well, Sardinia's dead. Uh, goodbye. You held out really long, my friend. And there they go. Now we just need to, to kill the Unhaunt. Yeah, so much fun. I love... I, I love... I love that. Uh, I guess I can call in these guys. Alright, uh, we landed in Africa. And... Uh, yeah, they're gonna die. I don't think they're gonna survive for much longer. Uh, someone is ready for round two, apparently. Well, and uh, goodbye, uh, sand friends. Well, uh, pushing into the German exile government. Where's my war participation, by the way? Well, thank you, but... <laughs> Hello? Where's my war... I capitulated them, for fuck's sake. Oh! That... that, that uh, Could've... Bit earlier, then I would not have wasted my time with a naval invasion. But whatever, whatever, I guess, whatever. Oh wait a minute! Don't tell me they nuked their faction. Why? Now I have to kill everyone. Shit! Oh, Canada is gone, and uh, I have to kill everyone. <laughs> Why are they still alive? What? Oh my! Really? Now I have to. <laughs> My god, I'm not joining the Russian war, but how the fuck can you lose so hard, man? What the hell are you- Why are they so trash? I don't get it. What the fuck? Uh, let's hope that rushing for the victory points uh, will pay off. <laughs> oh, it actually worked. Let's fucking go. Mine. It's just mine now. Francis fucking capitulated, man. <laughs> I don't care. I just want to be out of wars. Please. Why is Portugal still alive, by the way? They've no of course anymore. Come on, what the fuck is that? Please tie Norway, I don't wanna be in this anymore, man. Oh my god. Yeah, not like anyone else did anything, right guys? Nobody did nobody. Nobody did anything here. All they did is lose to Russia. That's that's their entire that's all they did. And now let's finally the constitutional restoration. The restoration of the presidency onwards to normalcy. The elections of 1933. President appoints Honorable Pacchiardi. This is where I'm going to end the video now. So thanks a lot for watching and I hope you enjoyed it. And please like, subscribe and leave a comment. And see you next time. Goodbye.